we're about to begin our road trip back to California from Georgia. How do you feel? <laughs> uh, I'm excited. I'm officially unemployed, <laughs> uninsured, and road tripping across the country. So Woo! But yeah. Straight hippie. We've lived in Georgia for the past like nine months, actually. Yeah. And yeah, this is our house. Not anymore. That we're, we'll be leaving. Bye we're going to miss it. Georgia, you've been good to us. But... No, we're sick right now. You have not been good to us. <laughs> okay, you were good to us. Yeah, every now. time Lucas and I want to like do something fun or go somewhere, we yeah. end up getting sick. We but went... we think it's just our allergies this time. We went to New York. Allergic. We went to New York on New Year's Eve. We were both super sick. And now we are trying to road trip across <laughs> the country. And we're getting killed with allergies right now. So it's yeah. the Bye, bye Georgia House. Love you. That's Georgia House. We're going to California House. <laughs> okay, so right now we're in Louisiana. We stayed three days over Easter weekend with some family in Florida. Yeah. So that was a lot of fun. We didn't we film. To, like, we didn't film because we were spending time with them, but we went to like the beach and stuff. And then we drove through Alabama and then to Mississippi. And now we're in now Louisiana, we're in Louisiana and we're gonna explore New Orleans. And this time I saw the signs, the <laughs> Welcome to the City signs. Yeah, on our last road trip. He I miss, literally miss every single I miss sign. like 13 out of 15. It was so annoying. <laughs> the only one I saw was Welcome to Georgia and thank you for coming <laughs> to California. The rest of it was just like, I don't know where they were. Yeah, but we're gonna film a bit in New Orleans and then we're gonna be spending the night in Baton Rouge tonight. Okay, so we made it to New Orleans. We just found parking. <laughs> New Orleans. <laughs> Stop! What? You say New Orleans? New Orleans. I say New Orleans. <laughs> but yeah, we just made it to um, like near the French Quarter and Bourbon Street and everything. We were here for like two seconds and there was like this marching band that was awesome. Like yeah, the batons. Yeah, and then the people and getting a, married. Did you see them? Oh yeah, these couples, <laughs> the married couple was dancing and they had another, what's it called, marching band like yeah. playing for them to get married and dance to. It was but yeah, awesome. it was super cool. In New Orleans. This place is amazing. <laughs> Okay, so we explored New Orleans. It was pretty fun. It is awesome. We've never been there before, so it was cool to see, even though we only spent like a couple hours, but yeah. it was definitely worth going to. Um, now we're in Baton Rouge, where we're going to be staying the night. We're meeting my sister and my nieces because they're driving and meeting us from Georgia. And then my mom actually flew in from California to come drive with us too. So we're all gonna be road tripping together from this point. Oh, sweet. Yeah, so it's gonna be fun. I wish we had more time in New Orleans because it looks like there's a lot to do there, but we didn't really have enough time. We just, so we just walked around, ate these fancy things. What are they called? <laughs> Beignets. Beignets. Is it cool? There's this dude playing the saxophone outside. Yeah, there's so many good musicians, especially this one guy. And <laughs> he started playing like Sia, like Chandelier. And However, <laughs> he didn't have any pants on. He had a piece of string around his waist. I didn't two, even notice. <laughs> with two art pieces, one covering his frontal, one covering the back. But if you, from the side view, you, you saw upper cheeks. So <laughs> he did not have pants on. But yeah, it, it was pretty cool. Yeah, he was awesome though. He was really good. Antonio, 